What's up everyone, it's Dan with Tools in Action. Today we're going over the General Instruments DDM4E. It's a uh, moisture meter for building materials and wood. Um, basically, it's a, uh, contact, it's a contact measurement tool. So it has these two little points on it that need to be in contact with the surface. To turn it on, you just hit this middle power button here for a couple seconds. And you get a audio indication. Obviously it tells you it's on. This piece of uh, 2x4 here, we actually soaked half of it in water a little bit. So obviously, I mean, you, you can even tell your skin off of it. So I'm 23, 24% moisture in my hand. Okay, so this is the dry end. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the dry Why end. Why are so uh, moisturized? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Okay, so this is the dry end, and we're getting about 10.6% moisture, okay? Now we're going to go down to the area that we soaked with water. So, we get about 15.9. It's drying out a little bit. It's hot out today. Let's try a different area. Okay, so there's an area where it really soaked in. Uh, we're getting, is it 31? 31.3%. So you can use this tool to locate leaks. Uh, it works on concrete, wood, plaster, carpet. Um, there's a button right here that you go from wood to just general build building materials. So that offsets the scale a little bit. You have a battery gauge up here. Um, audio indication like I told you about. A lock screen if you wanted to lock it. A uh, percentage to show the client. Um, after three minutes of not using the tool, it will automatically shut off to save bat battery life. It's powered by a 9 volt battery, which they do include. And uh, in the wood mode, it can do uh, moisture from 5 to 50%. And in the building material mode, you get 1.5 to 33%. So, all in all, it's a great little tool uh, to carry around to locate leaks. Or, you know, if you're installing a new wood floor and you want to check the moisture level, uh, you know, this is the perfect tool for it. So it's go good because, yeah, if you're going to put, like, any type of finishing or finishing on it, you want it to be dry so you can measure it. Right, exactly. You know? you know, and I know sometimes when you're doing wood floors, well, I'm not a wood floor installer, but I've been told that, you know, you have to put it inside the house, let it acclimate for a little bit just to match the moisture of the house. I don't know if that's true or not. Um, but... Go ahead and check out GeneralTools.com. Go ahead and check out AcmeTools.com. That's where we got this. You can order it right from Acme. And uh, check out ToolsInAction.com. And don't forget to subscribe to our videos. It really helps.